just arrived in Berlin Central Station and uh, first impressions, this is cool. This is a cool building, very modern, very well equipped with shopping access and all sorts. But look at the layers, look at the layers down to the platforms and everything. This is cool. You know I like train stations, but Berlin, you've done good to the first 30 seconds. I'm happy. Hello, hello, guten tag, welcome to Berlin in Germany. I was in Munich this last week doing some work with Adobe and uh, a lot of the work all kind of wrapped up uh, pretty quick and um, yeah, ended up having some extra time whilst in Germany. So I've made a last minute trip all the way up to Berlin, uh, a few hours on the train. It's glorious summer and uh, I've heard that this is one of the best times to visit Berlin. So we're gonna take it casual, we're just gonna explore around. Um, I might take some photos as well whilst I'm here and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna wander at my own pace. Of course, this city is packed with so many different experiences, whether you're here for history, whether you're here for techno, whether you're here for beer gardens, um, there is all sorts available to you. And um, yeah, we're just gonna wander as it comes. So uh, the sun is out, it's absolutely glorious weather. Um, I'm loving all the, the light just kind of like shining on the trees by the way. Uh, but anyway, the, the area I'm in is uh, near to Oderberger Strasse and uh, uh, Oderberger Strasse. <laughs> I've got plenty of pins saved across my map uh, for Berlin. Uh, it's like a, a good healthy mix of coffee, <laughs> beer and nightclubs. <laughs> and. Um, I've been kind of experimenting around, just wandering and, and um, just kind of seeing things. I've only really been here for like a day or so. Um, and uh, yeah, today I thought I'd bring the camera out as well and talk through some things. So the idea is that I just want to keep things casual um, going forward. Loving the yellow. Love the yellow. Berlin has definitely got yellow as a vibe. Um, so yeah, so the main idea is I just want to kind of keep things casual and just go back to super raw, super basic vlogs. As, uh, as you would have seen from a previous video, which was actually filmed a number of weeks ago now. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's a different, different outlook on life. Loving this yellow.
I've been walking around Berlin now for uh, a few hours or so. <laughs> I'm up to 22,000 steps uh, for the day. And that is the point that I want to raise, is that one of the best ways, and definitely my favorite way of exploring a new city and getting a feel for things, is by walking, just wandering, just walking, just follow the light, follow whatever catches your interest, your ears, the smells, all sorts of things. Um, you'll only get that if you're walking. If you're in a car or if you're underground um, or if you're just staying indoors, you're never gonna get the feel for a place. Um, and so, primarily, my favorite way of traveling is on foot. Um, and uh, second to that is, of course, gonna be on the trains. Uh, and a great thing about Berlin is there's uh, a pretty good train network as well as a tram network. And I've said this before and I'll say it again. A city that's got trams is a good city. I always get a good vibe from somewhere. There's something about places that have trams um, that just always leave a good impression on me. Um, so if your city's got trams, there's a good chance I love it. One aspect of Berlin that has absolutely delivered on my expectations is just the grit and texture. Uh, Berlin, kind of similar to New York, I guess, is known for like the tagging culture, the stickers, the graffiti, the street art. It is everywhere. Um, now, depending on your taste, uh, you may love that or you may hate it. I feel like for a city to start it is gonna be difficult, but for a city that has kind of adopted it and is well and truly covered in it, then it adds character. So it's uh, it's kind of a, an interesting thing, but quite literally everywhere you look, there is color, there is texture, there are the remnants of previous posters, political campaigns, demonstrations, all sorts of things. Sometimes it's just a funny meme on a sticker and uh, I'm kind of loving it. It's exactly what I expected of Berlin and uh, it's everywhere. Likewise, almost anywhere in the city, you can get a view of the Berliner Fernsehturm, the TV tower. Uh, this is one of the buildings that has been on my unwritten list of tall buildings to see, and uh, I'm glad to see it in person. And uh, yeah, it's kind of got um, similarities to things like the CN Tower, the Space Needle. Um, yeah, I just love seeing a big, tall structure that is a focal point of uh, photography and all sorts. Uh, likewise with the CN Tower, I'm probably not going to go up it today. Um, I like to see it. Uh, I'm sure the view from the place is pretty good, but I've only got a limited time here and uh, for the golden hour, the time when it would be best to go up there, I'm actually going to enjoy walking around uh, on street level of things. Um, but I've definitely got plenty of photos and all the different angles of it. And one thing that I find really quite funny about this is uh, Berlin is of course known for its nightlife and uh, one of the most iconic buildings in Berlin is of course <laughs> the tower which looks like a giant disco ball up in the air. I love it. It's um, really embracing the nightlife um, and for those of you who are longtime viewers of the channel you'll know that I am somewhat of a night owl. I will quite often be out until sunrise um, yeah, sometimes they make it on the vlog, other times not.